This is an instructional video for the use of the Billy Goat PL1803V PL1801H aerators. As with any Billy Goat product, review the operator's manual provided with the unit and also available at billygoat.com before use. When operating the equipment, use gloves and eye protection. Tip: Mark sprinkler heads and valve boxes prior to use as the tines can damage them if inadvertently run over. To prepare the unit for use, take it out of compact mode by flipping the folding handle up, making sure the set rings are above the hinge. Once the handle is in operating position, drop the set rings so they lock the handle. Reverse these steps to put the handle back into compact mode. To start the unit, set the on-off switch to on. Push the choke lever forward to choke the engine. Set the throttle lever to mid-range. Pull the rope to start. Once the engine starts, pull the choke lever back. Slide the throttle lever forward to attain maximum RPM for aerator operation. For the PL1801H engine, to start the engine, position the on-off switch located on the handlebar to on. Move the fuel shutoff valve to the open position. Push the choke lever forward to choke the engine. Set the throttle lever to mid-range. Pull the rope to start. To drop the tines into the turf, push the T lever in the center of the handle forward. To engage the tines, lift up on the tine engagement bale to meet the handle. When the tines are engaged, the aeration action will propel the unit forward. Tip: To get more holes per square foot, offer some resistance to slow the forward movement while the tines are engaged. Note: The handlebars are ISO mounted to reduce vibration. To pull the tines out of the turf, release the tine engagement bale and push the unit forward 6 to 8 inches. Pull the T-lever back until it folds up against the handle. Failure to push the unit forward after the tine engagement bale is released, before removing the tines from the ground, can result in turf or machine damage. 